welcome back to my channel. As you can see from the description, I will be unboxing my November Boxy. Um, as you can tell, it is a bigger box. Um, the size of it is a little bit bigger than the normal box. Um, I know there's been a few unboxings so far. Um, just Anne did her box and she didn't get her brushes. I do believe I agree with her. Joe did say that every charmer would get the brushes. Um, I thought the variation was supposed to be the Juice Beauty or the Caprice, let me see, let me get my information, the Caprice uh, Serum or the other variant item was the four dose of color lippies. You were to get either one of those or the Becca um, Shimmery Skin Perfector. Um, I didn't know the brushes were part of a variation. So I am hoping that this box has the brushes in it. And I'm also hoping that it has the Becca Shimmer, the, uh, what did I call it? The Shimmering Skin Perfector in here. Um, because in a boxy previously, I already got a dose of colors lippy in the shade, what does it say? Bittersweet. And I do like their formula and, and all that jazz. But since I already have it, I want to try something different. So I am hoping this box has what I want in it. So let's get started. I do have my my food scale, but I'm going to weigh my box. I'm clearing it right now, zero. I'm putting my box on it. And my box weighs 1.288 pounds. Do it for a second time just to make sure. Now it's 1.286, so something shifted, but it's still around the same price. So, um, my Sacto knife. For those of you that don't know, Boxy Charm is a monthly. Sorry, that's my neighbor taking a shower, I think. Anyway, um, or if you hear people walking up above, I've had some people stomping on the roof of, of my apartment complex some, for some reason today. Not sure why. But, um, BoxyCharm is a $25 a month. This is the first month um, that they upped the price to $25. And they did promise that it was going to be a bigger box, and it is. And, um, we'll see if I get all the items that are promised. So let's open her up and we'll all ooh and all at the same time. You open it up, the inside is red now. Hashtag boxy charm. And here is hmm. Boxy Charm Stellar. That's the theme for this month. Looks like that. And then on the back, um, I have information about Boxy Lux and Boxy Pop-Up pop -up and the information regarding the customization swatches. And I'm surprised to see this in here. I've got the foundation. I was thinking I was going to get that pretty vulgar um, under eye concealer. But no, I've got the Becca Ultimate Coverage 24 Hour Foundation Fondant. And here's the back. Here's all their different um, shades. And it looks like I did get the light shades. So um, we shall try those out. I've got cashmere, shell, and linen. And it looks like from what I'm seeing here so far that, oops, you can't see, from the shades here that probably this one or this one here in the middle. This one here is way too dark. The cashmere is too dark. Linen might be okay, it just depends. Shell, I don't know, that looks a little tan to me. But anyway, I thought I was going to get get that. This month's box is supposed to be valued at, oh no. It's supposed to be valued at uh, at least $200. So here's the list of everything that's in my box. Uh, Natasha Denona, 
I believe she's in the premium box. I thought they got that last month, but anyway. So I'm supposed to swatch this. Visit BoxyCharm slash, oh, BoxyCharm.com slash complexion and let us know which shade matches you. And then I'll receive complexion shades better to match me. So put that off to the side. That was my information. So I did get the brushes. The brushes are sitting right here in their nice thing here. This is... The BoxyCharm two-piece box set. Create your favorite looks in total luxury with our first ever BoxyCharm branded brush set. The large multi-purpose powder brush. Let's see, let's open this up. So there's two brushes here. One is bigger than the other. So I got my two brushes. They look they look like brushes that you would use for I don't know, these got stuff all on them. They're nice and soft, but to me, there's something I would use for contouring, not for foundation. This is the big one that they're saying is perfect for a powder brush. It's perfect for liquids, creams, powders, and mineral products. I don't know. I personally, it's, it's big, but it's flat. You see, it's got this weird shape to it. So, I don't know. But the brush tips are very nice. precise foundation placement and seamless blending. I don't know that I would use either of these brushes for what they're designed to on your face. I mean, pretty much I'd want to be using this as like a setting brush or something under the eyes and this as like a or a blush brush and this as like a contouring um, contour or a bronzing brush or either one for the same thing, so I don't know. We'll see, but the fact that these two brushes alone are $22, you mean to tell me that these two brushes are $11 a piece? Or one's a little bit more than the other? $22 for two brushes when I can go, I, I don't know, go and get e.l.f. brushes? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I can get, well, I take that back. Luxy Brushes gives you a set of five brushes for $50. So, um, I don't know. We'll see. The next item in here is the Dose of Colors Liquid Matte Lipstick. And this is in the shade Nude Mood. So, I got one of the Nuder Sticks. Um, even though I, not, I tell them I like red. So here's what it looks like. Uh, let me see if I can find that other lipstick. Where did it run off to? Yeah, it's the same as this one. Looks identical. Looks just like it. Except this is a more neuter shade and this is red. Um, bittersweet. This one is nude. Nude. Looks like that. Um, let's try it on my... I know I'll get some use out of this. Oh, it's got the typical doe foot applicator. So I'm going to add this right here on my hand. You'll see it. So it is a nudie shade, but it does have a little bit of like a, I don't know, underneath. It looks like it's got some red in it. But it is a very nudie brown shade, but it looks like it's got a little bit of something in it because it's not totally all brown and this so we'll see how much is this the dose of colors our liquid matte lipsticks has a velvety high matte high fashion matte finish which envelops rich in rich long wearing color it applies as a creamy liquid but after a few minutes it dries to an ultra comfortable matte finish $18 so we'll leave this on my hand and we will see so the next item is that, I, this is the item that I chose um, 
when they allowed us to choose. I chose the Caprice uh, Antioxidant Dew Quench and Glow Serum. Looks like this, and it is exactly 1.59 fluid ounces, and it cost $90. Remember, I said I paid 25 bucks for this. So, $90 in this box. That's a lot of money. So let's see, what does this do? Directions, apply several drops to clean skin morning and night. So what is it? So it says on the box, the description is, it's an antioxidant do lavishes the skin with quenching and comp and <laughs> encapsulated antioxidants, nourishing amino acids and an array of soothing botanicals. Use as a lightweight lightweight hydrator or as a layering piece in your skincare wardrobe. Made for skin desiring a kiss of hydration. And the reason I picked this is during the winter my skin gets so dry. So I am hoping here's what the bottle looks like. And if you can see the back here, it says made exclusively for BoxyCharm. So, um, I'm hoping this will help with keeping my skin, um, hydrated. So, we shall see. But what does this tell me over here? Any of, oh, it just read what I just read on the box. So, I am, I am seriously hoping that this will help keep my skin, um, more hydrated and if that is the case I may use it on my hands because right now my hands are cracking and um, all that jazz wonderful fun and then I feel like I'm missing an item one two three four oh there it is it's in the bottom of the box so the next item is the item that I knew was going to be in this box. This is by Dominique Cosmetics. It's their Celestial Thunder um, Eyeshadow Palette. And this, did I say how much? Oh yes, I did, $90. This costs $35. Bucks. And, oh here's the thing to cover it over. It comes with a pretty decent size mirror. And... Here's what the bottom of it looks like. So let me remove this from this. Put this down here. Here's what it looks like. It looks like that. So let's start swatching. So we will go, we'll do the top four first. Got my handy wipes right here. All right. Come on. Put that over there because I'll need that in a few minutes. So what does it tell me about the this here? Celestial Thunder is an explosion of vivid pigments, shadows, and glittery foils with eight in... Oh, ugh. why can I not talk today? It's like I have a serious problem with trying to talk. Glittery foils with eight uniquely formulated shades for a creative colorful eye look or a simple pop of electric color. These vibrantly made shades tell a cosmic story and bring the universe to life. So from what I'm seeing, the three colors right here, one, yeah, this one, this one, and this one are your glittery, the glittery foils. And then the rest of them Dude, it already looks like someone put their finger in this palette. I didn't touch it. But let's do our shimmers up here at the top. We did get um, Dominique Cosmetics. There's the pigment payoff of the top four. I'm going to put them right here. Let me see if I can build up that first um, glittery shade and that black shade over here because I like this goldish one right here this one that looks really nice 
My swatching is really bad. I'm really sorry about that. I don't know. This, this shade here on the end, I don't know. It's not, it's not, I don't know. Oh, let me wipe off my fingers. So let's go to the bottom. The glitter doesn't come off very well off my fingers. Look at that, it's still on my hand. All right, let's dry them off. All right, and get it all off. There we go. So let's try this bottom row where it's the more colorful end of the spectrum in the palette. So we got this bright, what is this? magenta, this burnt orange, an orange, and a teal. Let's get a little bit more color on the fingers here. So here's what they look like on my finger. And let's swatch them right next to these other ones. There's that pinkish. See, the color payoff in these ones down here are a tad bit more, in my opinion, pigmented. This brown I don't know what's wrong with it it's just not it's not coming but here's the palette swatched there's that lip so here's the palette um even that light shade right here that isn't coming across that light shade right here I guess you can kind of see it to me, it just looks like a bunch of sparkle on my on my wrist, if you can see it there. Anyway, it looks like a pretty decent palette. Um, I may have to work that brownish black shade that's sitting right here, the one here at the end, because it's very patchy. It's not, see this here? It's very patchy, so I don't know. These other ones, they look very highly pigmented and look to, I don't know, oh look, there's the lipstick, it's totally dry folks, let me clean off my hand and get rid of the wetness on my hand, so I can show you, oh, it's not totally dry yet, but there you go, it is going to transfer, because from what I just saw, it's transferring, so this is pretty good. What did I say this was? $35? I think so far I'm doing pretty good. The thing is, everyone says the PR packages get better products. I think I'm doing pretty good. I got everything that was supposed to be, um, well, except for the Becca Cosmetics. And then I also have the Tula Skincare Star Bright, the Probiotics, Probiotic and Superfoods. Star Bright Nourishing and Brightening Cosmic Hydrogel Mask. I get two of them. I'm glad they give us two so that you can try it at least more than once um, just to see um, how it is. So the probiotics in here help to calm the look of inflammation and aid in moisture retention. Like I said, in the winter, my skin dries out. Um, it may not look like it when you spray it with the the glow mist that I put on from Pixie, um, it, my face looks really hydrated right now, but my skin is so dry. This also has grapefruit in it. It says it's an antioxidant and superfood that brightens the appearance of skin. There's chamomile in this that calms and soothes and relieves the look of red skin or redness. And then it's got this go-to kula. An herb that conditions the skin and helps improve the look of elasticity. Okay, if you say so. And it is 100% free from phthalates, parabens, mineral oil, sodium lauryl sulfates. Sodium lauryl sulfates are the stuff that it's foam that when you use uh, cleansers and stuff on your face and it foams up, that is the sodium lauryl sulfates doing that. It doesn't have formaldehyde. And they are um, cruelty free. So I'm looking forward to trying out this box. 
I think, um, how much are those? A set of two is 20. Uh, this is $22, two masks. Again, these are $11 a piece. I, I wouldn't buy these if that's how much these are. They're, for masks, this is a bit expensive for me. These better hydrate my face. I don't know, make me walk out of here looking like Cindy Crawford kind of skin. You know what I'm saying? For $22? Um, anyway, I do think we did a pretty good job here. Let me add up the total. Because I've got my handy bandy calculator right here. I got the two masks by Tula, which in my opinion, I don't know, that seems a bit overpriced. Two masks, two masks are $22. I've got the Dose of Colors Lippy, which is $18. I've got the Kypris, um, what is this? The Kypris Antioxidant Dew, the Glow Serum, that's $90. Plus the two brushes, which, again, I don't know. This is $35. I read the wrong amount. I thought this was $22. These brushes, two brushes are $35. Oh. And then, oh yeah, the palette. The Celestial Thunder palette. They're retailing it for $35. I'm coming out to a total of $200 exactly, if you can see that there. Um... I think those brushes are overpriced. I would not spend $35 on two brushes. As I said, uh, Luxie will give you five brushes for $50. $35 for two brushes? Boxy, come on now. And then I've also got the samples of the foundation. Um, I'm not trying to complain or anything. I do like this box. I think uh, for my value, I, I I definitely got my value's worth. This cost $25. I got five items that are all over, except for the eye masks. I mean, basically those masks pay for the box. They're $22, but I paid $25. So, um, I think I did pretty good on this box. Um... We'll see what I think about this lippy, if it does wear away. Yeah, it's going to transfer, because it's transferring all over my hand right here. So, um, anyway, but it is drying down. As you can see, it is matte. It's drying down matte. So, I do hope you all are having a great day, and I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye, everybody.